Hi, I'm Kavya and I go to Singapore American School and I'm 14 years old and I'm in ninth grade. For my straw project, I derived pi using two methods. The first method was the polygon method and the second one was the Monte Carlo method. So in the polygon method, you can think of a circle as a polygon with an infinite amount of sides. So I took a normal polygon and I adjusted it so that you could increase the number of sides on the polygon. And the more sides that the polygon has, the more similar it would look to a circle. And then I calculated the perimeter of the polygon and used that to approximate the circumference of the circle. And then I divided it all by 2r to find pi. For me, it was really crazy that it works that way, especially with the polygon method, because I never really thought of a circle as being similar to a, shape, a normal polygon with a controlled number of sides. Aristotle coined the term first principles thinking, and Kavya's project is a perfect representation of this. One need not boast the ability to memorize hundreds of digits of pi. Here, Kavya has shown you just a method with which she can tell you the digits of pi to an infinite number. When faced with new problems, a student like Kavya shows the ability to derive the solutions by first principles instead of retrofitting and forcing in pre-memorized formulas. I'm confident that Kavya is the person who's going to solve the unforeseen problems of the future with her creativity and with her problem-solving skills. So what I mainly enjoyed about this project was the geometry aspect of it because I love geometry and I think it's really interesting because it's kind of fixed, but at the same time, there's a lot of things you can discover about it. At first, I've been doing computer science or coding since I was in second grade. And I think that my passion for computer science has changed a lot. Now, I think it's more interesting because since I'm really interested in math and science, I can connect it to other topics. So it's inspired me to take computer science at school and in the future, because in the future, I wanna do something to do with math or biology, and I think that coding could really help me visualize my ideas and make everything simplified, and it could help me run through my experiments or ideas. Well done. Okay. <laughs> very, very well done.